he's fantastic. Dil Dylan Minnette is so um, generous and kind and courteous, and he's he's pretty he's pretty much Clay. Like Clay is sweet and lovely and just ever giving to Hannah. And every time I got on set, you know, like playing Hannah Baker, it's it's kind of like going through six months of bullying. But every single scene that I had with Dylan, it would always put a smile on my face. He would always be the kind of light of the day. And he's just, sorry, I'm, I'm rambling because he's just so fantastic. He's great. He's so nice. Athens, uh, she's amazing. She's probably literally the nicest person you'll you'll ever meet. And she's so, she's so talented. I mean, it's, it's crazy that this is technically, I mean, her first real job that she has done. And you would never, ever assume that working with her or watching her on screen. Um, and that's what's amazing. Like when I when I when I got the part, I didn't know it was me playing Hannah. And then I saw uh, Catherine Langford, and I never heard of her. And I looked her up, and I was and she didn't really have anything. That's what I was excited about because clearly they weren't going off some weird politics of like trying to get someone with that'll attract people to the show. They got someone who would be perfect for Hannah, and that's what they did. Um, and it is still is that way now. She's the perfect Hannah. It's amazing. Everything that we see in the show is stuff that I've seen and that I'm aware of. You know especially mental illness, you know, depression, anxiety, particularly when you're in the kind of later years of high school, it's really intense. And I definitely, you know, as a young adult and someone who's not so far, far out of high school myself, I've seen that and the effect that it has on people. Kids nowadays or young adults are so much more in tune with these issues than, you know, say they would have been like a couple of years ago. So I think it's just like, this is such an important thing that we're showing truthfully and as authentically as possible. For people who don't understand, that these issues that people go through, it's, it's you kind of are, have to be forced to see these things take place so that you know, you can distinguish what's, what's right and wrong. 